You're not attacking me? You are attacking me. Oh, never mind. You're not attacking me. You're, you're robots on my team. Hello, guys, and welcome back to some more Fallout 3 Mudded. Uh, you guys just enjoyed watching me, huh? Just enjoyed watching me being trapped. They didn't even hesitate. I, I guess they didn't like you guys. Well, they, they probably didn't see you as a threat, to be honest. They, they probably didn't care about you. They're like, maybe they were threatening to kill me if you guys did anything. You know, if that was the case, then respect, you know? And I don't know why they want to give me my stuff. It's, it's kind of stupid of them. Not saying it's not a bad kind of trust, but I'm, I'm I'm saying that you know, based on my history with killing bad guys and stuff, not exactly right the best there. thing. You're supposed to be in that holding cell. You're not going anywhere. There's a full complement of guards in the next room. As soon as I get them, you're going back to your cell in a body bag if necessary. Excuse me. Whoa, whoa! Let's calm down. I'm supposed to be here, okay? On whose authority? I have no records of that. You're supposed to be in a holding cell. The president wants to speak to me in his office. What? No one sees the president except Colonel Autumn. Stand right there while I check this out. Okay. Uh, Mr. President, I'm sorry to bother you. Uh, this is Lieutenant Williams. I have an unauthorized individual here who says he's supposed to speak with you. Yeah, yeah, yeah true. Yes, sir. Uh, I'm sorry about that. I, I just... Uh, it just seemed out of the ordinary. I apologize. Apology noted, Lieutenant. Yes, I instructed our friend to come up to the control room. No questions, no interference. Am I understood? I understand, sir. Again, I apologize for the interruption. Allow our friend to pass and report to your superior for reassignment, Lieutenant, at once. Yes, sir. All right, cool. Now, now, please don't try to kill me. Attention to all Raven Rock personnel. This is your president speaking. I've invited our guest from Vault 101 to my office. Please do not impede his progress. Thank you for your cooperation. Well, five. Oh, cool. You're doing quite well for yourself. Keep following this hallway. Okay. Hello. Well, hello there. Pleased to meet you guys. Not really. I don't like you, Enclave. I uh, I still want revenge. You killed my dad. I don't like that very much. Surprise, surprise. Not exactly my favorite thing to, to do. Hello there, Enclave soldier. Having ghouls in there and... Uh, Brahmin hits? And of course, super mutants. So what I understand from uh, from how the super mutants and stuff are created and, and such, uh, the Enclave creates them. Uh, I'll try to create them, and then if they create them, they dump them out in the wasteland, and then they rescue the people from the super mutants, or they try to get rid of the um, the Brotherhood of Steel by using the super mutants to get rid of them. So they can take all the glory and kill the super mutants and take over the wasteland after the super mutants are done. Now that is one understanding I have made. The other one is that they are currently studying how to get rid of super mutants and all mutants in the wasteland in general. And we are going to get an offer from the president soon that I remember. That's very interesting. Uh, and kind of shows the whole enclave perspective on things. So they're kind of just studying them to get rid of them. Which I don't know if it's true or not. So uh, that's something to um, to try to research, I guess. I try not to spoil myself too much. These are all like things I have come up with myself. So I apologize if I am very incorrect. So this is the wrong hallway, right? Because there is no, um, no way to you from here. Hello. Is it this way then? I don't... I don't really know what way is what. Hey. 
Hey, hey to you too. I will take a guess and say that I need to go down here. Or not. Yeah, I doubt I'm supposed to go down here. Where is this door? There has to be a door somewhere that I can use. Mr. President, uh, you wouldn't happen to know the way out from here, right? So I am here. This map is not helping me whatsoever. That's the exit. That is where I am. I need to go this way. Maybe. Then maybe up here. Excuse me. Excuse me, what now? Well, I guess they, uh, don't want to kill me anyway. Seems like the whole system is corrupted. Oh, oh well, you can't argue with, uh, with, with my weapons now, can you? Alright, Mr. President. What the heck is going on with your enclave troops? Ooh. Don't mind if I do. I guess I just need to go around and kill them now. Enclave Commando. Uh, excuse me? Why are you in my face? Alright, uh, there we are. God damn. Oh, they killed the cockroach. Or the red roach. Now where am I? Hmm. <laughs> Do I go up? Wait, wait, wait. I have another map. Why, why don't you just look at that one? Uh, local. Want to go all the way up. Uh. Aha. So it's not this way. Excuse me, I am lost. Can you perhaps help me? Wait, aren't you the guy who was like... Oh, Nathan, what? Why did they take Nathan? How about that, huh? This is 3A. And 3A is... I'm not good at directions. So there should be a door to my left over here. Right here, right? Sorry, Duke. No, you're not attacking me, but your enclave. It is this way, right? It is. It's supposed to be this way, at least. Then I go in here. So I was at the right place. It's just above me. God damn it. And I guess it's up here. Yes, it is. Okay. At least we got it in the end. 
First stage, Gimme, 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 gimme. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Need to really respect this colonel dude or whatever his name is. What the heck? President, why, why are you not doing other stuff? Help me out here, please. Raven Rock, where the heck is that even on the map? Oh. You bet you failed. All of you will fail unless you stop shooting at me right now. More experiments, I'm guessing. How's it hanging? Uh, hanging great, Butch. Hey, what's no, 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 stop, Butch, you're just in the way right now. Thank, thank you, thank you. There we are. Okay, so these are robots they have been messing with, it seems. Alright, go, 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 go. Where am I now? More areas where they have stuff? I will kill all your troops if that is what it takes, dude. Oh, it's a death claw. Well, that's cool and all, but it's kind of creepy too. Oh, we don't want to run away, huh? You better. Wait, why can't I? Oh, dang. Here we are, Butch. Tell them how it is. Tell them how cool we are and everything. You? What are you doing here? What the heck are you? Wait a minute, what are you doing here? They, they captured me. Brought me here from Project Purity. I didn't no, they want didn't. To help them at first, but the technology they have here. It's so far advanced from anything I've worked with. What have you told them? They wanted information. About Dr. Lee, about Project Purity. They want to know how to start it up and why it wouldn't work. I told them everything I could. About the Gek, about the damage caused by the explosions, all of it. You betrayed Dr. Lee and my father. I'm sorry you see it that way. What are you going to do? Kill me over it? You should go. It sounds like you're in enough trouble as it is. And honestly, I don't want anyone to see me talking to you. It sounds like you're in enough trouble as it is. And honestly, uh, I don't want to see me talking to you. That was actually an accident. Nothing yet. Oh well, it's kinda now. I'm going to find you. I don't want anyone seeing you talking to me, huh? Well, I'm happy that I killed you. That's what you get for betraying us, by the way. Did you just have told us or sent a message or something? Instead, you betray us completely. Cleared out, I guess. Oh well. Don't realize that your actions get people killed, huh? Okay, anyone else wants this? Come on now. 
Most of I can't loot. Ooh, bubble head. Energy weapons. Uh, arrive at peaceful resolutions by using superior firepower. I mean, that's that's something. Not too shabby. What is sex destruct sequence? I'm not entirely sure Eden can be trusted. And I think he knows I don't trust him. But I don't think he knows I have the emergency destruct sequence for his console. Priority override. Authorization code 4200-03209. And boom. It'd have to be a last resort, of course. But at least the option is there. Aha. Uh -huh. All right. We go to this place then. You're not attacking me? You are attacking me. Oh, never mind. You're not attacking me. You're, you're robots on my team. Okay, what the heck is going on right now? Like, wh I, why is he helping us? Please proceed. Sure, I'll proceed. Oh, well, you're going to see a blood twist in a second. Don't know if I told anyone about the president, but I don't think I did throughout the whole playthrough, even though I might be wrong. Blood twist. That's Mr. President. Ah, face to face at last. It's high time we met. I'm quite pleased you were able to make it. The trip was not what I had intended but serves as an adequate test of your abilities. If we're meeting face to face, then show yourself. Don't hide behind a monitor. Ah, but I have. I'm right here before you. Your computer? I should have guessed as much. Are they open-minded of you? Kudos for embracing the reality of the situation, rather than railing against it. Let's get to brass tack, shall we? There are some things I'd like to talk to you about. And uh, what is that, if I may ask? And what can I do? No, I'm listening. Our nation's capital is at a crossroads. The path that you and I choose here today will affect us all. I need you to act on my behalf to ensure that our country's future is secured. Can you explain what you mean exactly? My abilities to influence the world are limited at this time. I alone can only do so much. You, however, may come and go as you please. You have a greater degree of freedom. Perhaps it's best if I explain why things need to change and why I'd like you to act on my behalf. All right, say whatever you have to say. Our land is ravaged by mutation. The war was so many years ago yet we still suffer from its effects we cannot move forward until humanity can gain a solid foothold in the world to do so we must rid ourselves of the mutations that have plagued us for so long these super mutants ghouls hideous creatures i believe your father's work can do that in a way unlike any other Okay, I see. But that's, this is the world we have now. We had our chance as humanity. We had the chance to live without mutations and such. But we failed. So, um... We have no one but to blame to blame but ourselves. So, uh, let the super mutants be here. And let the ghouls be here. And let them fight humanity on even grounds. My father's work, how is that relevant? Purify your father helped create has the ability to provide clean water to the whole of this capital wasteland. With a simple modification, it can be used to distribute agents that destroy mutated creatures upon ingestion. In time, we could eliminate all mutations in the wasteland. At the same time, the good people of the world regain their health. I need you to make the modification necessary for this to succeed.
how exactly would I go about doing this then? In front of you will be a vial of modified FEV virus. It can be inserted into the control console for the purifier. Doing so will inject it into the water supply, and the purifier will take care of the rest. You just need the code to activate the purifier. Simple, isn't it? How can I trust you? I don't trust you. And everything you've been spewing in the radio and about you going up against this guy isn't enough for me to trust you at all. What if you, as an as a robot, is trying to turn everyone into a mutant instead by using the water? I actually don't know if if he does that or not. I, I don't know if that's a pos uh, that is a possibility, but I don't know if that is something he would do, or if it actually kills all the mutants instead, or is human to be humanity to be here. No, I'm not doing that. No. I find that unfortunate and most disappointing. I must impress upon you the severity of the situation. I cannot allow you to leave unless the vial is in your possession. This has to end, Eden. You need to destroy yourself and this base. And why would I do that when I'm clearly the best hope for the people of the Wasteland? You can't just decide to take over and force everyone to follow you, no? You can't even control your own troops. You're clearly not fit for this. Perhaps. Perhaps you're right. But does that really mean all this progress should be wasted? Destroyed? If you don't stop it now, where will it end? It's up to you to do what's right. Yes, I suppose it is. Very well. You shall have your wish. Once you've left... I'll put an end to the Enclave. I cannot stop Colonel Autumn, however. That much will be up to you. I suppose then that... Okay. This is goodbye. You'll have to see yourself out. I have preparations to make. Alright, I've got some newfound respect for you, President Eden. Alright. You still want me to take it, huh? Fine, this is goodbye, Mr. President. Respect goes to you, though, for taking your own life and destroying the Enclave. You have been a big pain in my ass. Get the heck out of here, though. Well, goodbye. Have a great time. I don't know if this is something I'm supposed to do or what's going on, but... Can I just... Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. I don't know, am I supposed to run? Oh, I think I'm supposed to run. Well, I'll just run. You know, I don't need the supplies anyway. Tunnel snakes. It's no, not tunnel snakes right now, but we need to leave this place. It's very important to leave this place right about now. You know, it's gonna explode. It's gonna kill everything in here. Something down here? Oh! I mean, I know I'm supposed to hurry and everything, and I just so spoke about hurrying and not looting, but, you know, I just can't help myself. It's, uh, it's too much good loot for me to ignore it. And even if it's not, like, exploding my face, it's still worth it. Please, please do not explode in my face, though. That would be, um, kind of bad. Got to go. All right, Capital Wasteland. Here we go. The heck am I right now? Oh, it's night time. Oh, it's Fox. Oh my goodness. This is, uh, explosive.
Very explosive. Fox, where the heck are you? Go over. Oh, there you are. I found you at last. Oh, hello. I knew you had survived, and I had hoped to assist in your rescue to repay my debt to you. Looks like you got a new tie, huh? Yes, and the most fascinating one at that. Wow, this technology is amazing. Imagine the evil that can be eliminated with such tools. Oh, for a second there, I thought you were going to say something else, Fox. I thought you said, imagine the evil we could do. But no, okay, good. Uh, Fox, what the hell are you doing out here? I saw your capture and a little cleverness allowed me to follow your captors. Ugh, I only wish I could have arrived sooner to aid your escape. Are you adding me brutal plenty? Okay, Fox. Freedom, I felt it was only fair that I return the favor. After all, I know no one else in this world. I could always use a hand. Would you like to follow me? My friend, I would be honored to follow a hero such as yourself. Shall we go? Indeed we shall. Are you... Something. Uh, yeah, I would like to give you guard mode. Uh, set essential. Oh, you glow, glow with the guard. Okay, good. Good. I really don't want to lose you. Alright, cool. Now, by the... Okay, goodbye, Ongleave, I guess. It's, um... Wait, who are you? Dog meets puppy. Good boy. We got a new dog meat. Good teeth, strong claws. You're a fighting dog, aren't you? Don't worry, I'll, I'll, I'll get you in my group, okay? Friend, guard mode. Now you can't die anymore. I probably said at the beginning that I shouldn't... Um, what did I say? I, that I shouldn't, uh, like, take advantage of the fact that I can't die, but... It, it's fine. We got a new dog meat. We got dog meat puppy, and I'm gonna treat you better than dog meat. We already had our tragic backstory with everything, so we don't need any more people to die. Even though it could still happen. But by my hand. But don't worry, I won't kill the dog. <laughs> it's a little bit extreme. Alright, now where the heck are we in the map? Oh. Huh. Well, that is, um, quite far. Alright, well, that is also gonna be for this video. It seems like the Enclave is destroyed. We did it. High five. Pew, pow, pew. Pow, pow. We got a new follower, Fox. And uh, we got a new dog meat puppy, and dog meat puppy is gonna help us the big time. I'm gonna call you DP from now on, okay? All right, DP. I don't remember. Did I tell you to follow me? I don't think I told you to follow me. Um, never mind. Did I? Never. Uh, maybe I did. All right. Okay, well, like I said, this could be another video. The the end. Oh, sorry, I speak a little bit too much, too fast when I'm excited. Um, but yeah, hope you enjoyed. Uh, if you did, consider liking and subscribing. I hope to see you in the next one. And as always, stay awesome.